Hi everyone, it's Ahmed Sawi, a student of Sharjah American International School, SAIS. Uh, we are doing our science fair, so we constructed a model, it's about a reed switch motor. Me and my colleagues, Hassan Shakir uh, and Ahmed Zarawani, supervised by our physics teacher, Mr. Shadi Qassas. We will be talking about in this video uh, uh, about the materials that we used to build this model, the procedure we took to construct it, uh, our hypothesis, our, our, our observation, our conclusion. Hi, it's Ahmed Zarawani. I will talk about the materials and the procedure of our experiment. First of all, our, our materials include four permanent magnets, battery D size, reed switch, copper wire, and wires. Now I'll talk about the procedure of our experiment. First of all, we insert the pin inside the hole of the rubber. We masked the rubber with a plastic cover. We glued four permanent magnets around the plastic cover. We cut pieces of copper wire and we wrapped it around the screw and we taped the coils. After that, we held the coils with two stands and we connected the wires as a direct current. How the reed switch works? Uh, these are the four permanent magnets wrapped around the uh, rotating shaft and this is the electromagnet. The electromagnet is formed by the nail and the coil wrapped around it. So, when the permanent magnets comes closer to the reed switch, it closes the circuit, causes uh, an electric current to flow. When an electric current flows, it flows through the copper wires around the electromagnet. So the electromagnet is on. When the electromagnet is on, there is a magnetic field around the electromagnet, which causes a repulsion force between the electromagnet and the permanent magnets. This repulsion force causes the permanent magnets to move, as you can see. The repulsion force between the electromagnet and the permanent magnet. Uh, another step or another idea is that when the permanent magnet goes past the reed switch, when it goes um, uh, away from the reed switch, the reed switch opens, so the the circuit is open. So there is no there is no current moving. There is no current flowing through the through the copper wires through the electromagnet when the when the when the reed switch is open. So now I will be talking about our observation. What we observed during our experiment is that when the electromagnets were rotating around, were rotating. Uh, when we increase the number of loops of uh, copper wire loops wrapped around the nail, the the rate at which the rate of the rotation of the electromagnets increased. Also, when we brought these added loops into nearer or closer to the uh, permanent magnets, the, also the rate uh, of the rotation increased. So our hypothesis, which is that which states that uh, the rate of the ro rotation of the permanent magnets increase as we increase the number of loops and the closer the, these loops get to the electromagnet to the permanent magnets the, ro the rotation is faster so we proved our hypothesis thank you and goodbye